Hello, guys. Good morning. It's Thursday. It's not really relevant, but I thought I would let you know anyway. Today, Emin and I are going to my place of birth, aka El Dorado Hills, California. Regional Baptist Hospital. Kaiser Permanente. Mm. Anyway, I grew up in Northern California. I have a teeny weeny little small hometown in the middle of nowhere, and Emin and I are gonna go drive over there from San Francisco because it's about an hour and a half away. We're gonna see my old house. We're gonna see some places that I used to hang out with my family. You know, some good childhood memories, maybe recreate some. <laughs> anyway, I'm really excited. I've seriously been wanting to do this for so long. And I'm very excited. I already said that. So let's go get in the car and go on a little mini road trip. How do you feel? I'm quite excited. Are you excited? That's all I have to say. You look good today. I shaved my face so I have all these red marks. You see him? He looks good though, right? Okay guys, we made it to El Dorado Hills. I'm extremely excited. So, the first stop on our little EDH hometown tour is Town Center. If there's somebody who is from El Dorado Hills, which most likely none of you watching are, you know that Town Center is pretty much the only place to go and the only place to see in this tiny ass town. So, I'm basically gonna take Emin to Nugget, which is the old like grocery store, I guess, that I used to go to and get pizza with my family at every week. And then I'm gonna take my old house. But let me show you guys Town Center while we're here. All right guys, so I'm currently at Nugget Market, which is basically a really fancy grocery store. And me and my family used to come here every single Wednesday to get pizza when I was a kid, and it's my favorite pizza ever. Huh? Are we on camera? <laughs> yeah, totally. Hey. <laughs> I'm on camera, shout out the boy, AP Stoner 916, go follow him. What, what, what? Amazing. <laughs> We are parked in the middle of town center. My dad built a lot of these buildings in this area. Not a lot, a couple of them, a couple big buildings. So it's super weird being here. My parents used to take me all the time. All right guys, so if you don't know, I'm on a quest, you know, trying all the different oat milk lattes that I can find. Because if you don't know already, oat milk latte with honey slash oat milk in general is our go-to coffee order. So we've been getting them at grocery stores a lot, like Whole Foods and stuff. So I decided to try this one today. It's from e Equator Coffees. Equator Coffees? I almost said Equator Coffees or Equator Coffees. Do you know what the equator is? Yeah, of course. It's very good. It is not super sweet. I would prefer if it was a little bit sweeter, but that's just my own personal taste. Most people don't like that, so it's pretty good. This is so weird. I have nothing to say. Oh my God, this is so weird. Oh my God, we're here. We're in Toronto. Oh my God. Okay, so if you go to the right right there, that's the country club. Okay, that's so, where you ran away. <laughs> so when I was a kid, oh my God, wait, this is my favorite part of the neighborhood. We'll oh get to the God, story in a second. What the hell is this? We'll Danny? get to the story in a second. I want to show you guys Danny, the neighborhood. This, place is crazy. this is the most beautiful part of the whole drive, in my opinion. My parents live in a neighborhood like this. A lot less cool than this. When I went to their neighborhood, it was the first time I've ever seen a neighborhood like that. Until like two days ago, I've never seen a neighborhood like this. Okay. This is actually a big shock to me. Why is it a big shock? I didn't know neighborhoods like this exist. Okay. I lived here when I was a kid, but coming back here as an adult, it really does feel like a different world. Like it feels like I'm completely in a different universe right now. We can't afford this. Hold on, this is my house. What is your house? My house is up here. So guys, we're at this park that I used to spend most of my childhood at because it's literally right across the street from my old house. Like we used to come here all the time. And what do you think? It's crazy. <laughs> it's crazy. And then all the stories she's telling me or she has told me in the past three years makes sense now. You always talk about going down in bikes and riding around. We're gonna go see the back now. Our last stop on our little drive around town is Apple Hill. Apple Hill is a place where my family and I used to go every Christmas and every Halloween to get pumpkins and Christmas trees. It's basically a place with hella apple orchards and vineyards. So we would basically go, we would get pumpkins, we would get like apple pie or apple cider or caramel apples or whatever we wanted. And then my dad would always make us go to a winery. So he would go to the winery and he would taste wine and then we would play in the vineyards and wait for him to be done and hang out and stuff. So we went to this place called Nugget and it was like a rip off Whole Foods with a cooler. And I got this water called Path Water. And the motto is 
refill, not landfill. And I don't know how to explain it. You can't crush the bottle. It's a thick piece of metal. It literally feels like a reusable water bottle that you would buy. Yeah. Which is like, cool, because now you have a reusable water bottle. Alright guys, we just got to Apple Hill, and as you can guess from the name, it's literally called Apple Hill. It's like known for its apples, apple pies, apple cider, anything like that, anything apple related. So we're gonna see if we can get an apple pie for Emmons family because you know who doesn't want a good apple pie? <laughs> <laughs> You're gonna love it once you bite into it, trust me. Do dogs love it? Yeah. All right guys, so we're here at this place called Bill's Orchard. Danny's inside getting an apple pie for my family, but look how freaking pretty this place is. I don't even know what the hell this is. But it's really pretty. Basically we got this thing called a sugarless apple pie because they didn't have any of the regular ones. So I don't know how it's gonna turn out, but it should be okay, I think. So we got some apple cider, fresh from the vineyards. Yeah, literally, oh, look it's from- Look, there's like apple chunks in there. Camino, California, which is where we are. Ready? Mm -hmm. Give me a sip. That is good. No sugar. Oh, you didn't get it? That is some fresh juice. Well, um, I can't have that because that's way too much sugar. Eight ounces, 30 grams sugar. <laughs> that's like per cup. We're going to take this home to Emmons family because they love apple cider. Guys, I'm so happy to be here. You guys don't understand. It's my childhood. I'm also happy I could show you guys my hometown because now you guys see where I grew up in my old house and everything. Like I've never put that on YouTube or anything, so right. I'm really excited. Hi guys, so we're back at the apartment and I thought I would just ask Emin before we sign off what you thought of everything and what you think of EDH and how the day was for you. Because I had a great time. It was a little bit rushed guys. We got there a little bit late and we were trying to get there to Apple Hill before everything closed and so we didn't have as much time as I wanted to have but it was okay. So what do you think? It was muy grande, very huge. Everything was grand. Yeah, it was cute though. I find it funny that you like it so much there and you would never live there again. Never. Ever. Ever. All right, guys. Well, thank you for watching. Let me know what you thought of my hometown. <laughs> and if you want to see any more content like this, comment below. Let me know. I'm always looking for video ideas. And I hope that you guys have a wonderful day. Please subscribe if you like my videos. And I'll see you guys later. Goodbye. Oh!